There are close to 100,000 people with Polish roots in Brooklyn and Queens. Many of them are at St. Aloysius, celebrating their heritage with a mass alongside Brooklyn's only Polish bishop, newly ordained auxiliary, Witold Morzecki. I am an immigrant. Uh, I came to the United States years ago as a newly ordained priest to serve to the diocese, and I am here. <laughs> Now as a newly ordained bishop. As a newly ordained bishop, that's right. And <laughs> With uniforms, flags and flowers, the Polish in attendance kick off a colorful celebration. Visiting from Poland, the main concelebrant of the Mass is Bishop Janusz Stopnowski. He encourages the immigrants to hold on to their customs, even as they make their home in America, and to enhance their new country with the richness of Polish culture. The Polish religion, our uh, saints, uh, Polish prayer, uh, Polish uh, literature or the poetry uh, is very important for us. That uh, uh, our roots. The leader of the Diocese of Immigrants, Bishop Nicholas de Marzio, is on hand to encourage the people in their faith. He compliments their constancy. The saying is Polonia Semper Fidelis, which means Polonia has always been faithful for a thousand years to the church. Uh, they've uh, practiced their faith in, in Poland and now as immigrants. They continue to practice it. They're strong in attendance at Mass. So um, th that's what they bring. They bring faithfulness. These immigrants hold two saints ever close to their hearts. The first Polish Pope, St. John Paul II, and the Virgin Mary, under the title Our Lady of Czestochowa. Also called the Black Madonna, the shrine that houses this miraculous image of Our Lady is located in southern Poland. She gives us strength and faith. So in more difficult times, we can, we can, uh, we can live uh, you know, our future life. At the end of Mass, the people present the bishops with flowers and give Bishop Demarzio and Bishop Morzecki traditional Polish cakes proud of the heritage they hold dear. I'm here only um, two years, so, you know, the Polish tradition is close to me. My, my parents are Polish, so it's important. It's, it's in me. It's a big part of who I am and how I live my life because my parents are from Poland. I'm proud to be Polish and living in America and of my heritage. I want to pass it on to my children. The Polish Heritage Mass is held every year. This year, about 50 young people celebrated alongside their elders. St. John Paul II himself emphasized the importance of young people, encouraging them and challenging them to actively spread the gospel everywhere. Reporting for Currents from Ridgewood, I'm Katie Breidenbaugh.